Mahahiran Arabic, Almharn the emigrants were the first converts to Islam and the Islamic prophet Muhammad's advisors and relatives, who emigrated with him from Mecca to Medina, the event known in Islam as the Hijra. The early Muslims from Medina are called the Ansar helpers". <laughs> During Muhammad's era About a month after Hamza's unsuccessful attack in the first caravan raid, Muhammad entrusted a party of 60 Mahahiran led by Ubaidah to conduct another operation at a Quraysh caravan that was returning from Syria and protected by 200 armed men. The leader of this caravan was Abu Sufyan ibn Harb. The Muslim party went as far as Thanyatul Murrah, a watering place in Hejaz. No fighting took place, as the Quraysh were quite far from the place where Muslims were in the offing to attack the caravan. Nevertheless, Sa'd ibn Abi Waqqas shot an arrow at the Quraysh. This is known as the first arrow of Islam. Despite this surprise attack, no fighting took place and the Muslims returned empty handed. It is believed that Ubaidah was the first to carry the banner of Islam, others say Hamza was the first to carry the first banner. Sa'd ibn Abi Waqqas was ordered to lead the third raid. His group consisted of about 20 Mahahirs. This raid was done about a month after the previous. Saad, with his soldiers, set up an ambush in the valley of Karar on the road to Mecca and waited to raid a returning Meccan caravan from Syria. But the caravan had already passed and the Muslims returned to Medina without a fight. The fourth raid, known as the Invasion of Wadan, was the first offensive in which Muhammad took part personally with 70, mostly Mahahir, troops. It is said that twelve months after moving to Medina, Muhammad himself led a caravan raid to Wadan. The aim was to intercept the caravans of the Quraysh. The raid party did not meet any Quraysh during the raid. The fifth raid, known as the invasion of Buwat, was also commanded by Muhammad. A month after the raid at Al Abwa, he personally led 200 men, including Mahahirs and Ansars, to Bawat, a place on the caravan route of the Quraysh merchants. A herd of 1,500 camels, accompanied by 100 riders under the leadership of Umayyah ibn Khalif, a Quraysh. The purpose of these raids was to get back what they lost when they migrated from Mecca to Medina to avoid persecution by Quraysh for practicing their religion. Quraysh seized the property and belongings left behind by Muslims and sold those. The caravan was led by 100 Quraysh and 2,500 camels were with them. <laughs> List <laughs> Men. Hamza ibn Abdul Muttalib, uncle of Muhammad Al Abbas ibn Abd al Muttalib, uncle of Muhammad, and the progenitor of Banu Abbas Salman the Persian Bilal ibn Riba Kunay ibn Hudhayfa Abu Dar al Gifari Meekdad ibn Aswad Amar ibn Yasir Abu Baraida al Islami Khalid ibn Sa'd Topic. Caliphs Abu Bakr, companion and father-in-law of Muhammad. Aisha's father. Umar, companion and father-in-law of Muhammad. Hafsa's father. Uthman, companion, second cousin and son-in-law of Muhammad. Husband of Rukhaya and Umm Kultham Ali, companion, first cousin and son-in-law of Muhammad. Husband of Fatima Topic. Women Meccan wives of Muhammad, apart from Khadija bint Kuwailid, Sada bint Zama, second wife of Muhammad, Fatima bint Asad, wife of Abu Talib, mother of Ali, and an aunt of Muhammad, Lubaba bint al Harith, wife of al Abbas, and an aunt and sister in law of Muhammad. Topic. Daughters of Muhammad Fatima, daughter of Muhammad and the wife of Ali ibn Abi Talib Rukhaya, daughter of Muhammad and a wife of Uthman ibn Affan Umm Kultham, daughter of Muhammad, and a wife of Uthman ibn Affan Zainab, daughter of Muhammad and a wife of Abu al as ibn al-Rabi Umama bint Zainab, granddaughter of Muhammad and a wife of Ali ibn Abi Talib See also Mahahir Al-Mahahirun 
Brotherhood among the Sahaba Sunni view of the Sahaba List of expeditions of Muhammad References, <references>